The first ever World SBK season opener to see seven different podium finishers. This is a race where it's all about being able to maintain your pace and your speed for 20 laps. This is where tire maintenance is really critical for these riders. The smartest rider will win, not necessarily the fastest rider. Well, this BK's 450th round, race one in Barcelona for 2024. Janone comes barreling through on Bulliger to take second place. This is Jonathan Ray coming into the pits. Miserable start to 2024. And Sam Lowe's has made it count to hit the front for the first time this season. Nicolo Bulliger stands up Andre Janone in towards turn one. Here is the move then for second position. Bulliger makes the pass on Raz Gatlioglu. Sam Lowe's is down from the lead on lap number five. So Nicolo Bulliger takes up the head of the field. Razgat Lioglu through on Yanone, so recovers second position. And Bautista's got that move done before they even come onto the start finish straight. Bautista's got it done before the start finish straight. Not the first time he's put in a move like that. Two laps to go. But if Bulliger slips into the late one minute 44s, Razgat Lioglu could be right on him. He's in those mid 43s, the only rider on the racetrack in the 43s. He's been able to pull back what had been the best part of a four second lead for Bulliger. Turn five might well be his best opportunity in the early stages of this lap. Razgat Lioglu has recovered four seconds on Nicolo Bulliger and now makes the pass for the lead on the final lap. Razgat Lioglu wins for BMW in here only his second round with the German manufacturer. A superb performance from him to nick the top spot from Nicolo Bulliger on the very final lap. Three scoring days and three different winners. Our two most recent races decided by a last lap overtake. It's BMW versus Ducati in Barcelona. Yanone loops as he heads in towards turn one, but he's got it stopped in time. He hits the front. Sam Lowe's makes the pass on Andrea Yanone. Lowe's making his dive down the inside into turn nine. The Lowe's brothers one and two. Well, Andrea Yanone looking for his first race victory in World SBK. So too is Sam Lowe's. They are one and two. We've got a race on our hands here as Alex now makes his lunge. So the pace is with Bullica down at turn four. He's through on the inside of Andrea Yanone. Yanone with the cutback is going to spin up the rear tire to try and pull back alongside. He's got the outside though into turn five. Oh, oh, and Alex oh. Lowe says, you know what? That's my opportunity. I've got to take it. Yanone now bundles Bullica out of the way. Brilliant racing in the opening five laps of this Super Bowl race here in Catalonia. Three abreast into turn nine as Razgat Lioglu goes from third to first. Three Ducatis in the top four positions. They're swarming around Razgat Lioglu in towards turn one. Tufts it out around the outside. That now becomes the inside and that moves Bulliger out of the way. And Bautista now is up into the podium positions, having started all the way down in 11th position on the green. Alvaro Bautista around the outside of Andrea Iannone. Bautista closing the gap in the slipstream as they come towards turn one for the final time. Bautista pulls alongside Razgat Lioglu and is through for the race lead. Last major overtaking opportunity for Razgat Lioglu on the brakes, but Bautista holds on to the race lead. It's going to come down to that last corner. We know how strong Bautista is through the final two turns here in Barcelona. It's not going to be his first race victory. He's been unbeaten here on Ducati Machinery for the last two years. But Razgat Lioglu will not allow Bautista to take another. And Bautista's relegated to third. Top rack Razgat Lioglu with back-to-back -back wins on the BMW in Barcelona. We know the talent from Razgat Yoglu. Now we also know that the BMW with a lap record in the Super Pole session and race victories in race one and the Super Pole race this morning. We know what that bike can do as well.
Alvaro Bautista has hit the front. Top back, Raz Gaplioglu, the pole sitter, already relegated down to fourth. Locatelli, Bassani and Rinaldi might have all gotten together down in towards turn four. Nicolo Bulliger holds firm on the outside. He'll have the inside now for turn two. Raz Gaplioglu, though, will have track position. The rookie ducking out of the slipstream to try and pass the reigning world champion. Bolliger is through. And we expect that Bautista could be strongest of them all in the final third when tyre wear is at its greatest. Bautista is the master of tyre conservation. Bautista through at the start of lap 10 on teammate Nicolo Bulliger, the current championship leader versus the reigning champion. Andrea Iannone in the gravel trap has come down from fourth place. The reigning champion versus the rookie. He's back. Alvaro Bautista with four consecutive podiums and a first race victory in 2024.